Hi guys! I am very nervous and excited about this vlog because it's going to be about my eye surgery. In this video, I will tell you everything about my experience thinking of getting a LASIK method but it turned upside down into an ICL method. now and I'm on my way to my very first consultation appointment. I will take you guys with me. Let's go! I am back from the consultation appointment which took only about 30 minutes. So what we did was two eye tests and they checked my corneal thickness to make sure it's not too thin so we can laser the eyes. In this case, everything was perfectly fine. The doctor said I have a wonderful and thick corneal thickness, which was, I guess, the weirdest compliment I've ever gotten. Until that point, I was still thinking to get a LASIK method to laser my eyes. But everything changed at the second appointment, which will be... Today is my second appointment and it's going to be a checkup appointment. They are going to take a deeper look into my eyes and that's why I have a driver with me today because I won't be able to drive with a car or train or bus, whatever, after this appointment. And I am very, very happy because tomorrow I can wear my contact lenses again because I had to wear my glasses two entire weeks until this appointment today. And after today, I can go back to contact lenses until my eye surgery. So yeah, I'm very excited. I will take you guys with me and I see you at the doctor's. have my hands in front of my eyes because they want to measure how my eyes are by night. This examination appointment took about two hours. They did eight tests on my eyes. My pupils were also dilated for some tests. And this is what came out. My wish method, which was LASIK obviously, cannot be used on my eyes anymore. The doctors found some tiny scars on my corneal, which happened because of my corneal inflammation a couple months ago. And because of this one corneal inflammation I've ever had in my entire life, I cannot laser my eyes anymore because it should be too dangerous. And by the way, I got the inflammation because of my contact lenses. Maybe the scars will disappear someday, the doctor said, but not soon enough. And I don't wanna wait any longer. Now we will use the ICL method for my eyes, which should also be amazing. So, ICL is also known as an implantable contact lens. During the procedure, a doctor implants contact lenses permanently into your eyes. I know this sounds scary, but I promise it's not. So at this point, I had to wait until the lenses were finished being produced. This can take one month or even up to three months. After that, we have set a date for the surgery. So I just got ready and I'm so nervous because today is my eye surgery appointment and it's going to be two surgeries all together, one today and one in two days, which means today is Tuesday. So on Thursday is going to be my second surgery with a second eye. And I'm super, super nervous because I've never had an operation with a general anesthesia before. So I'm actually double nervous. And yeah, my doctor called me yesterday just to make sure I won't cancel the appointment. And he told me I should bring a towel. He mentioned not to eat anything six hours before the surgery. My surgery is today at 3.30 p.m. So I should have breakfast at 9.30 the latest. And he mentioned to avoid dairy products. Uh, what else? He said not to drink anything two hours before the surgery and I think that's it. Did I mention I'm nervous? Right, it's going to be so weird without glasses. Where are they actually? So I'm gonna put my glasses on for the very last time. 
Oh, and also you should not wear your contact lenses five to seven days before your surgery. So get rid of your contact lenses and wear your glasses for the very last time. And it's still such a weird feeling to get rid of them. Yeah, so I would say let's go and I will take you guys with me. So the procedure before the surgery was, first we have done a COVID test, then I got some eye drops and we did some more tests, and then I was already in the surgery room. Okay guys, it's time, I am about to go in and I see you guys in about an hour. I am back home and I'm doing great. My eyes are not hurting, my eyes are not burning or anything. I'm doing great and I'm not feeling dizzy anymore, finally. So other than that, the surgery took around altogether three hours, but the surgery took 30 to 45 minutes. But altogether with all the checkups before that, it took three hours, roundabout. So the doctor mentioned to not read a book or any text messages today because it's not good for the eye if it's moving to the right and left all the time. So basically I'm just going to sleep or I'm just gonna chill in bed and get some rest. Because tomorrow at 10 a.m. I have another appointment at my doctor's and they're gonna check if everything went well and if my eye is doing great and they're gonna get rid of this here. And on Thursday, in two days, I will have my second surgery. I did not record the second surgery because it will be just the same as on the first one. <laughs> so great I have no pain and the redness on my right on my left eye is gone as well and two days ago I had an appointment to check my eyes again and everything looks perfectly fine just one thing which is kind of disturbing me but it's totally normal so when you look at some bright light I see like a ring in front of me but the doctor said this is totally normal my brain has to get used to it and it will disappear in a couple of weeks so I have an appointment in I guess in a month and then we'll check my eyes again maybe until then it will be gone but it can take a little bit longer but I don't even really care because the thing is I can see and everything went so fast in four days I had everything done and I got new eye drops I have to take them three times a day so in the morning midday and in the evening so I'm definitely super happy with my decision to get my eyes done with the ICL method it was the best decision ever I can see everything so clear and I still have to get used to it that I don't have to wear glasses and contact lenses anymore because every morning I wake up first thing I'm like where are my glasses <laughs> It's such a great feeling. Oh, and by the way, I got my hair done as well. I'm a bit blonder now. So new eyes, new hair, new me. Nah, I'm just joking. And I'm going to make a list with all questions I've got on Instagram regarding my eye surgery. So I will make the Q&A later on or maybe tomorrow. We'll see. So let's start with a Q&A. So the first question was, is it painful? No, it's not painful at all. My left eye was really red, but it disappeared after four to five days and it's totally normal, but it did not hurt. How long does this operation take? The operation took around 30 to 45 minutes for one eye. You have to get both eyes done, so it's 30 to 45 minutes for one eye. Were you scared? I guess everyone is scared if they have a surgery appointment, but I was actually also excited and nervous for the result. You won't even really notice that you will have surgery because it was like, let's do this, this and that and that and then I woke up. Like, it was so fast. And you see everything really sharp now. 
I do. I see everything so clear and I feel like a totally different person like I told you before. It's just such an amazing feeling. I see everything perfectly clear. I'm also having ICL lens surgery. How long did you have to wait? Um, I did wait about two months for my lenses. Were you able to see sharply right after surgery? So basically after surgery, I had like an eye patch on. When they took my eye patch off, I could see everything so clear. Of course, there were moments when I saw some things blurry, but it was just in the beginning. And they said it's going to be better every day and it really was. So one day after the surgery, I could see up to 80%. And I think it was one week after I could already see 100 and now I can see over 100%. I am 16 and want to laser my eyes. Is that possible with that age? As far as I know, you have to be 18. And I personally wouldn't recommend it because as I remember, I was, I was 20 years old back then and I wanted to have an eye surgery or get my eyes done. And they said, I'm still too young because my eye will grow until, I don't know what he said, about 25 years old, I guess. And he recommended to wait until then because the eye is going to change in that time. But as soon as you turn 18, you can go to a doctor and make an appointment and talk to him. Like, because I'm not a doctor, but I would just recommend to wait until like 25 at least. How much does it cost? 